Hi, I'm Keith Becker from Didi's Rentals. We're talking with Christine Mendez, the marketing director here at our office. We're talking about Craigslist scams in particular and the ways that tenants, potential tenants, can lose their money to unscrupulous people. Is this a problem? It's a big problem. I see this all the time. I do deal with Craigslist often and I would say the most important thing for people to remember is if it's too good to be true, then it is. If it looks too good to be true, then it is. Um, if there are, is an ad on the computer saying, you know, Western Union has some money and we'll send you a key, that is definitely a scam. Never use Western Union. Um, and never rent a property sight unseen. If an owner is not willing to meet you or a representative of them is not willing to meet you to show you the property, then there's a problem. That's a red flag. Um, we actually use a watermark on all of our photos uh, to reduce the possibility of someone you know, stealing our photos and posting fake ads. Uh, we still get people that post a lot of fake ads um, on Craigslist and I get calls about that. Um, you know, if, if you're in the rental market, chances are you sort of know what a three bedroom, two bath is going for. If you see one that's listed $500 under the price you've normally been seeing, that's probably a scam. So your recommendation, one, visit it. Don't rent property set and seen. But if there's anything that's like a contradiction, somebody says, I'm renting it myself, you go out and there's a sign out there, who do you believe? Definitely believe this, where the sign's coming from and make that phone call. This is Keith Becker. On behalf of Christine Mendez, thank you very much. Mm -hmm.